All right, guys, welcome uh, back. Now we are going to uh, look into that thing called the smoke. We're going to see what it's all about. So uh, we got through all that. We went through expand the cave. We got to uh, all those uh, teenagers run off. Now we're examining the cut down line. We got that examined. So we think somebody had um, intentionally cut it down. So now we see this column of smoke. I don't see how a campfire can get that high. But you know what? I'm not going to argue. So uh, I'm going to go examine this campfire. See if we can't find them bitches. What we got here? Supply drop. Thorfare. Okay, well, I'm not going that way. Going up here and kind of seeing what we can find. Is there a way up right there? No, there's not. Little pine trees. Oh, they're fresh pine so, trees. Did you break any hearts back in Colorado when you took this job? I myself have chosen to never get attached to anyone who would miss me, but <laughs> I know I'm a bit of an outlier. I don't mean that the way it sounds. I mean, I care about people, and I like companionship as much as the next person. But why does it have to come from the same person for your whole life? My Aunt Kathy was married to the same guy for four decades, and when he died, she found out he'd been having an affair with a real estate broker for oh. 15 years. Oh. Whereas my Aunt Judy traveled the world dating artists and musicians as she saw fit. Call me crazy, but I'd rather spend the week in bed with Sonny Bono than half a lifetime with some cheating stockbroker. That's kind of fucked. Should we say, say I don't have anyone, or I'm married? Let's see what happens here. No, I didn't break any hearts when I left. So you guys broke up? Something like that. And you're just bursting at the seams to talk about it. You really are very perceptive. I know. It's one of my many gifts, along with accents and impeccable night vision. Incredible. Why, thank you very much, Governor. Dun, 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 dun. Wait, we can't climb the rope. I got, I got a fuck ton of rope. I guess you wouldn't lie when you said I had a lot of rope. We're getting closer to that column of smoke. I still don't understand how a um, little campfire can get that high, but you know, it is what it is. <sighs> Canyon, we're gonna report it. I'm down in Thunder Canyon. I'm not seeing that smoke anymore. Oh, it's still burning away. Try heading west from where you are. If you loop past the lake, there should be a trail that'll take you further south. Thanks. That helps. Put our compass away. Let's go ahead. I keep wanting to press shift to run. That's so much, you know, you think I'd be what they'd make it as. But, you know, I'm not going to argue. It's a beautiful game. I really like this game so far. So, glad I bought it. So, I guess we're going to continue going westbound and see what we can come across today. Oh, here comes the music. Really? You're, you're gonna tell me that I can't jump down that? Are you fucking kidding me? I was about to say, it's a little bitty ass rock. Oh, this is some nice water. You get you a drink there, bud. Well, um, let's see if we can find these bitches. Yeah, I'm not seeing the smoke anymore. She said I keep heading west. That's where we're going. It leads you to a trail. This trail, I'm guessing? Possibly? Maybe? We're so I far away. I you fell prey to the Forest Service's big recruiting effort. When it comes to, you know, how the hell you ended up out here. I saw the job in the paper and figured, you know, what the heck. What the heck? I've got no ties and no life. Better go spend what's left of it in utter loneliness. <laughs> Something like that? That is completely fucked. Now, thanks to last summer, the bump in Forest Service budget actually allowed for us to advertise for the job. Glad it worked. What happened last summer that accounted for this, um, windfall? Jeez. I mean... The federal government almost let Yellowstone National Park burn to the ground? Ring a bell? Yellowstone is like, what, 15 miles away? Why would they do that? 
Well, the short story is that for 60 years, we got very good at not letting forest fires happen. And then about 15 years ago, they decided that forest fires in wilderness areas like Yellowstone should be left to burn. So that's what they did. I can't believe you didn't hear about this. There were reports that the entire park was gone. Dan Rather telling the country that President Reagan didn't care on the nightly news. I report this fence yeah, when she just has to shut up. Jump in and snuff one out for the Gipper. Hey, uh, Delilah? What do you got? You found him? Uh, no, not yet. Why would there be a fence out here? Oh, uh, because sometimes hikers go ass over tea kettle when on a trail. So the Forest Service would put up a big chain link fence? A chain link fence? Yeah. It looks like it surrounds a huge area. Huh. That's weird. Hmm. Do you think those girls could be behind this fence? Hmm. Well, having once been an ornery young woman, the last thing I would do is climb a fence. Especially if I knew I was in trouble. Yeah, I don't even know how I would get in. It's really strange that that's out there, by the way. Yeah. It's weird. Well, now what I wanted to do? Blue stone? Well, maybe I can break it with this. That didn't do shit. Okay. Um. What am I supposed to do now? That's the question. Ah, let me in! Let me the fuck in! You know, I could literally just climb right here and go over it, but this game doesn't have logical sense, you know? Anyway, well, I guess I'll go back down. Try to find some other way to get up there. I saw these two rocks down here. What's that noise? Oh look, there's the column of smoke. Alright, so we gotta figure out how to get up there. You know, if it makes you feel any better, you're a member of a diverse club of lookouts that have come to the thoroughfare after a breakup. There was Vernon, whose wife got put away for running cocaine. Becca, who was widowed after her husband, a jockey, was trampled by his horse. And Sharon, whose boyfriend had his own boyfriend. Maybe you boned the neighbor. Maybe she boned the neighbor. Maybe you both did. I don't judge. And if you ever want to talk breakups, I'm your gal. We didn't break up. We didn't choose to break up. She got sick. I... I'm sorry, Henry. What is it? We'll get into it. Okay. Well, in the meantime, you are here, and it's beautiful, and escaping isn't always something bad. Yeah, oh, look sure. at that. That's so pretty. Yeah, I'd love to be out here, you know, just camping. It'd be so nice. It just looks so nice. Now, is there a way I can get up here? Oh, I don't tell me I gotta swim. Is Calm with Smoke still up there? Yeah, it is. I'm gonna guess I have to swim. Obviously not, because I can't go very far. That's the trail that I just came across. Come on, where is... Oh, the flashlight's on? Jesus, I'm gonna waste my battery in this fucking flashlight if I keep pressing it. There's gotta be a way up here. There's gotta be. Gotta be, gotta be, gotta be, gotta be, gotta be. Alright, well, I'm not seeing a way up here. See, like, a logical sense of life. You could climb over these fucking berms. This game is just like, nah, nigga. You ain't climbing over that berm, motherfucker. You gotta find your own way around. Wait, I guess I didn't come for this. I guess I... Oh, okay. I, I'm a retard. I guess I didn't come from that way. From this way, I mean. So we're gonna follow this trail and see where it takes us. 
This is literally where we just were that one time. Remember we stomped this fire out? Okay, what the fuck? Calm the smoke's still there. Yeah, this is where we were that one time whenever we, um... You know, uh... Told them girls to go fuck themselves. Fucking fireworks. Is there a way up over here? Or literally do I have to go all the way to fuck around? This trail? I guess we're just gonna keep walking until we find a way to get up here. Oh yeah, there's this trail down here and we have rope this time. Space bar to repel. Alright. So we are... Have? What does she have? She's got Alzheimer's. Like, um, dementia. Alzheimer's. How old was she? Is she? She's alive. She's with her family in Melbourne, Australia. She's 43. Fuck. Yeah. What was it like when you guys found out? Devastating. Especially for her. You can understand. And for you. Anyway, everything she worked for was taken away, and that was it. Yeah. I'm sorry to be such a downer. Don't, don't, don't even. I'm happy to listen. And, you know, we'll try to have some fun this summer. I promise. Missing persons flyer? Mike, Mitch Michaels, 31, 62, 165, brown eye, brown hair. Identifying features, distinctive facial hair, general for Michael, Mike, Mitch Michaels. Was last seen around Jersey Lake, July 3rd, 81. He was reported missing July 29th, 81 by four service personnel. He's not known to be familiar with the area. Mitch was seen around Josie Lake in the morning of July 3rd, 1981. Vehicle info is 7240 F250, blue and white. Montana license plate 2807326. If you have seen, contact them or have more info, please contact Shoeshine. Shoeshine. Shoshone? Shoshone? National Forest Dispatch at 307-555-66241. Well, I have not seen him, but I'll keep that for my records just in case we find him. Continue our hike. See what else we can get into up in here. Up in here, up Boy, for as dry as it is this summer, there's an area down here that's uh, lush. Oh, you must be talking about the aspen grove down there. Yep, yeah, aspen, I think aspen that's trees. Where I am. Those trees are actually one root organism. Did you know that? Hmm. I didn't. Yeah, they share their water as a colony that can live for hundreds of years, wow. even through fire. Can you believe you're actually getting paid to learn all of these amazing things? Also, uh, by what it looks like on this map, you'll be coming up on a stream that should lead you towards where we saw that smoke. Yeah, there's a stream right here. Man, this is really nice. Found one of their empties. Guess we're on the right track. Roger that. Oh, there's a waterfall. It's a really nice waterfall down here. Given those girls love a skinny dipping, I bet they're nearby. Uh, there's some cloth out here. It looks like it was torn from something. Strange. I'll keep looking around. Alright, so we found a waterfall. I guess we can walk up in here and see all this just for a fucking cloud of smoke. There's the smoke. I see a campsite and it looks like they've got a fire. Is it them? No, it seems like it. I swear, they must have dragged four cases of beer out here. Track them down, and don't let them see you. What a job this is. Stomp out the fire. We don't want it catching fire out here. Well, I found some dangerous hunks. What on earth are you... It's the name of a magazine for girls. It's on the ground here at their camp. I have entered the teen zone. Oh, really? And 
Where's that? It's another one of those magazines. <laughs> oh, damn, there's a case of beer. These girls have a full case of beer left here. A full case. Well, they're impressive little shits, I guess. That is some dedication. Alright, so I guess we're going to continue. Their tent looks like it's been through the shredder. Which would explain that scrap I found. What could have done that? Like a, like a bear, or um... I don't know, it sounds crazy, but even a bull elk if it's off its rocker. Whatever did it, did not hold back. You've got that camera, right? It might be a good idea to get a few snaps, just in case. Yeah, good thinking. I have to take a picture of this. All right, so let's see what this note has to say. Uh, looks like someone left a note. Intriguing. Ma Hope you're fucking happy. We're leaving and we're going to find a place where, place or whatever. Tell them about how you creeped on us to the lake, and then came and destroyed our campsite and all our stuff. Oh, and stealing panties is gross out. So you're probably a mental fucking axe murderer, and you're so going to jail. Hope it was worth being jerk or some fireworks, dick. Maybe you should read it. Okay. Yeah. Let me know what it says. Oh, they're gone, for sure. Well, what's it say? I'm threatening to call the police because they think I attacked them. Oh my god, well, did you? Like, I didn't do anything to them, but it looks like someone had it out for them. Then why do they think it's you? Fuck, I don't know. Huh. Hey, I don't. I believe you. Come on, Henry. All right. All right. It's just, it's weird what happened out here. Weird stuff happens in the woods. It could be other campers. They could be having a bad mushroom trip. We really don't know. But they're gone. There's no way to call the cops. They're not coming back. And we can get to work. I'd really like to start enjoying a quiet summer. Yeah, me too. All right, everybody, that's going to conclude today's episode. I really hope you did enjoy. If you're liking this series, go ahead and give me a thumbs up. Uh, comment down below what you think about it. And uh, don't forget to subscribe for more of uh, this series and other gameplay such as 5M, LSPDFR, and uh, etc. Um, so we'll see you guys on the next episode. Thanks for watching. Have a great one.